Today on the Stay at Home Chef, I'm showing you how to cook crab legs. No need to pay expensive restaurant prices, it's super easy to cook your own crab legs at home. In fact, cooking is the easy part. Today I'm gonna show you three different ways to cook crab legs, and I'm also gonna show you how to eat them, because that's the hard part. The first option is to boil your crab legs in salted water for five minutes. Super easy, but some people say the crab loses a little flavor with this method. The second option is to steam the crab in a steamer basket for five to seven minutes. The third option is to broil the crab legs, so you'll first wanna brush on some melted butter or olive oil, and then place it six inches beneath the broiler setting in your oven. The broiler method will be three to four minutes per side, so yes, that means you'll need to flip them. Next, it's time to get ready to eat some crab. To serve up your crab legs, you'll need some melted butter, lemon wedges, and if it floats your boat, some Old Bay seasoning. There are three different parts to snow crab legs. You have the cluster right here, you have the legs, and you have the claw. We'll start with the crab leg, and you wanna just break it out of its socket. Then you have the little hinge here, so you're gonna snap that. Then there's a whole bunch of meat in here, so I'm just gonna gently bend this until it cracks open, and then you can just slip the meat right out. And then you just dip that in the melted buttery goodness. You can squeeze on some lemon juice if you want, mm, and take a bite. Next, let's look at our claws. So let's pop off one of the claws from the socket, then break it off at its hinge, then you have the little pincher right here, so you're gonna snap that out and pull out the membrane. And then there's a whole bunch of meat inside the claw. So you can either use a nutcracker to crack open the shell and access that meat, or you can just use your teeth. If you peel back enough of the shell, you can pop that claw meat right out. And if you wanna go Maryland style, and use some Old Bay seasoning, the best way to do that is shake some out onto a plate, then just dip your crab meat directly into the seasoning. Then you can dunk it in a little more butter, and you have some Old Bay spiced crab. Mm, so good. And that leaves you with the cluster. There's a ton of meat inside here, but it's surrounded by a shell. You simply peel back the shell, and you should be able to fold it open and expose the meat inside, and then you can use a little fork to dig out the meat. Whether you're out at a restaurant, eating it on a date, or simply enjoying your own crab legs at home, now you are gonna be a total pro. Mm, so good. Thanks for watching. As always, you can find the full written instructions in the video description. Be sure to subscribe, like, and follow, and check out the rest of my videos where you can find hundreds of restaurant quality recipes you can easily make at home. See you later.